What's going on everyone, Jimmy Manistor is here, back on some Forza 7, uh, time around, coming at you with the S13 Coupe. I'm gonna do a uh, build from the very, very beginning. So let's go ahead and see, first things first, gotta put the booty on it, gotta put the booty. Doesn't do too much, uh, I mean, I guess it's pretty... No, it's it's really just a little, 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 little bit. <clears throat> Excuse me. Boom on. Uh, what do we have? It's an SR in the car, and I think I did an SR in the in the S15. But that's an S15 SR, so that's that's uh, that's a whole another story. Now, can we take the wing off yet? No. Rocket Bunny it is. What about the hood? Ooh, carbon fiber hood? Hmm. Hmm. Mm, nah, nah, nah. Alright, uh, tires. Put them sports. We got 205, 235, 240, 245 seems alright. <clears throat> rears how big can we go 285s jesus okay well 255s for now what kind of wheels do we want and I, I forgot you can't use rb to skip through all this now that's kind of annoying these gram lights don't look half bad I'm not gonna lie I think I'm gonna keep him that small too, just because. Drivetrain, you guys already know this is all be, gonna be race. This is the only bad part about doing the builds like this is having to go through uh, everything. I mean, at, at least the menus aren't as slow as they were, I guess. But still, and the reason the reason that we do you know race drivetrain most of the time is just to get the shifts quicker the power to be held a little bit easier the race brakes of course you know we want to be able to stop and <clears throat> control the car a little bit better coils better handling obviously roll bars uh people have been saying that that stock roll bars um for people on controller are or is is a lot better so we're gonna we're, we're gonna see because unfortunately I am back on a controller because my Thrustmaster TX uh, just stopped wanting to connect. It it just gave up on life. So I think it's really just the USB cable, and unfortunately that's the only cable that cannot be changed. Go figure, right? All right, 216 horsepower, and we're on sport tires. We're gonna probably have to fully build this <coughs> let's see two seventy three three sixty two okay okay I mean the car weighs what twenty five hundred so we might not actually you know what we're gonna see how far we can get without doing the turbo we're gonna see how it feels without the turbo we're gonna leave the stock uh, T25 on there. Did I do it? Yeah, okay. Whoops. And oil and cooling. 400, 470 horsepower. Okay. 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 And I'm sorry that my uploads haven't been consistent. Just, I've been playing other games and, you know, yada, yada, yada. Uh, let's see here. Alright, gearing. Let's see if I can remember this correctly. Boom, 170, 146, 125, bring that up just in case we ever need to, you know, cruise at some higher speeds. We're going to rock a whopping, uh, you know, we'll just do a flat out three. We'll leave that at a uh, negative point five, negative point two in the rear, seven caster, can't do nothing with the roll bars. 
Uh, we'll do a, we'll just do a hundred split and see how that goes. Uh, ride height, you already know. All the way, as low as it can go. Three nine and four five, that is so weird. We're gonna go with nine seven, she doesn't have a lot of power. Kinda want it a little bit stiffer than usual. Do eight six. Six four. 6-0. Oh. Let's, let's just see how it works. You can always change it. Break stiff. Apply. Apply. I said apply. Hello. Thank you. I kind of like how the car looks as is. I'm not going to lie. I just, I, I was thinking about painting it real quick, but I kind of like how it looks. It doesn't look bad. Now comes the fun part. And when I say fun part, I mean loading screens. Silverstone, no thank you. Where to go? Where to go? Um, 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 um. I really don't know where. Do we go to Rio? You know what? Let's do Rio. Let's let's do the mountain circuit. Uh, which way is that? That is the big downhill. Let's, so we're going reverse. Okay. One lap doesn't really matter. Shit! I just did that. No driver tires, please. Uh, let's just make sure that collision is on. Yeah, that would have been bad. Okay. Now to wait for a loading screen. I'll probably end up cutting the video here. Okay, well, the loading screen wasn't that bad as I thought. I guess uh, their first update kind of kind of changed that. Now that I am back on a controller. Excuse me. I am going to go back to manual clutch. Um, all right, test drive. Let's see. Let's just see. 470 horsepower, 245s in the front, 255s in the rear. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, well, I don't think it needs three degrees of camber. And I could probably lower the final drive. I was a little twitchy. I think that's probably, probably because I have it set so stiff. Okay, so what I say? Uh, so let's lower this. Let's bring that down to like 353. Uh, let's bring you down to like 2, 3. Uh, do you 8, 8. 7, 3. Five, five, and a four, nine. Okay. Yes, apply. Thank you. Oh, the exhaust is gone. No! 
Oh shit. Oh shit, we're we're everywhere. Okay, it doesn't feel as twitchy. So I may have lowered the uh, may have lowered the thumb drive a little too much. Let's fix that while we're on the straight. What were we at? Like 370? Because it didn't feel like it needed that big of a change. Just with a you know 470 horsepower car, I feel like I don't need don't need to be in fourth gear while drifting some of the turns. Oh shit. That was almost really bad. I think I should probably turn fuel and tires back on. So let's, uh, let's, uh, let's see assists. I forgot why I turned that off. I, th I think it's because I was playing with some friends and they they had it off. And we were in the lobbies for a while and I was ending up at like 60-70% way before I even noticed. A couple more laps here and we should... I mean, I'm sure the tires are up to temperature by now, right? Is it down on the D-pad? Okay, that's weird. It's up on the wheel. Okay, so yeah, they appear to be at temperature. I can see where I would need more power. I can definitely see that. Definitely see that. And I'm also like pulling the e-brake way too much. That's a really bad habit of mine. Is just pouring the e-brake out. I gotta say, car feels kind of solid now. Okay, 230. Okay, 230. Did I, did I take weight out of this? I don't remember. Because if I did, and we're at 2500, that means I could probably get away with more power and a bigger tire, right? Let's check. Let's check. Let's do a quick check of Rue here. Alright. I didn't. Jesus. Okay. So I think 255 is all I can get by with being at 2,600 pounds. Let's, uh. Let's see. Hello, thank you. Oh my god, that's a that's a big jump in horsepowers. We'll see what happens. We'll see how she rocks. Alright. 
One more time. Give it a couple laps to really see how the car feels. Build the boost though, it's that was not a perfect drift game. Hey, got rid of the wing, and we're spinning. Okay, let's, uh, let's check something here. I feel like it's a tiny bit too much power. Tiny bit. So. Let's see what we get when we go down to, let's see. 41, what did I say? I had 470. Let's try it on, or at 529. Okay. Here we go. Probably not going to rev as high. But that's okay. Baby, come back. Temp, wear. I feel like I feel like cars start to feel better around like 10% wear, maybe maybe like 5%. That's just me though. Car does feel pretty good. I can like I can weight transfer, which is nice. The uh, uneven pavement of this track is kind of the killer. Okay, okay, let's go S13. We're just gonna throw it, right? No! That would have been so cool. Oh, I went fifth. And there we go, turn the throw it again. Alright, well, well. I think I spent enough time driving this thing, guys. I think it feels pretty damn good. Um, for what it is, 
you know, I think it's under 500. Is it, is it still? Okay, it's still S class, which is good. So I think if you wanted to compete in, in, in ESGA and you did want to use this tune, you know, you never know. This thing might work. You might win some things. I'm not saying my tunes will take you to the top, but it might work. Um, I think it feels pretty good. I feel like if uh, you were to tweak it a little bit more to your likings, it could probably be the perfect car for you. Never know. Anyways, guys, it's me, Man Destroyers. I'm gonna fucking send it right here. And I'll see you guys later.